This is Pisky. It's the front line. From here, Ukrainian government forces can see the separatist positions around these two tower blocks without needing binoculars. Incoming fire from separatist positions hits a nearby building. Volunteers from right sector, a Ukrainian nationalist group, are quick to return fire. The men fighting here say that holding Pisky is the key to control of Donetsk airport. Ми не даємо нашому ворогу розгортатися. Якби ми його маємо можливість прямо на марші їх подавляти. Вони ж в той же самий момент ми стоїмо на висоті, вони нас не бачать, вони не можуть адекватно по нам працювати. The fighting in Pisky has caused extensive damage. 2000 people once lived here. Now only around 100 remain. Amid the abandoned buildings, they mark their houses with signs saying people live here. Ни воды, ни света, ни отопления, ничего нет. Мы живем как цыгане. Солнце стало утро, солнце село вечер. Natalia has stayed largely to help her neighbors. Lydia is in her 70s, so is her bedridden husband Petro. They've received no pension payments for five months, so they live on handouts. Petro has diabetes and is running out of insulin. They don't know where to get any more. They say they're disappointed with the government and don't understand why they've been left without help when the Ukrainian flag is still flying here.